Good morning. <gasps> what time is it? It's 8.17 and I just got back from dropping Dave off at camp because I guess he had another day to work and I thought that he was all done yesterday. But I have to work at 10.45. Hi buddy. Hi. Mulligan Alley between the bit and the wall. I have to work at 10.45 and I'm just kind of hoping that they're going to text me or call me and say, hey, do you want to actually work today? And maybe I'll get cut like I got cut last Friday and I won't have to work. That'd be pretty sweet. Right, Mulligan? He's my handsome kitty cat. I'm gonna fall asleep now. They didn't call, so I guess I'm off to work. Just got ready in 10 minutes. I actually got up from a nap 15 minutes ago. So I'm gonna leave for work. I'll be right back. Hold on, hold on. Next clip, ready, go. My head hurts so bad. Now that that complaining is out of the way, I'm home, which I'm really excited about. Since work is done and I don't really have any plans for the rest of the day and I feel like crap, I think I'm just going to put on some comfy clothes and shut all the shades in my apartment and chill. Just hang out and not do a damn thing. Tomorrow, I'm going to Shelby's bridal shower and I will be bringing you along for that. I did ask Shelby ahead of time if I can record all of these events of her life, the bridal shower, bachelorette party, pre-wedding, reception, because I'm in the wedding so I can't really film the wedding ceremony, but I think that's something that you should be present for and I don't think anyone should really have a camera in their hands during that time. You'll be able to come along for those other rides though. That knock was just my neighbor that lives right next to me. And as you guys have known, if you've been watching the vlogs, that neighbors constantly move in and out of this apartment building. I had loud upstairs neighbors when I first moved in and then they moved out and I had another set of upstairs neighbors and now a whole new family has moved in upstairs but the woman right next door just asked me if i could take her package in for her cool not a problem what was i talking about i'm not doing a damn thing for the rest of the day and edit eat and sit in the dark i'm just gonna shut the shades and pretend that the world doesn't exist and hopefully i can get rid of this headache i was wholeheartedly considering going to the gym today but I sprung for the medium iced coffee today. I usually get the small, but I thought maybe this would help my headache. So in between bars last night, we we're hanging out outside of you know who's. We we're on our way to Silver Street, excuse my messy apartment, and I was hungry. And Dave and all those other guys went out for Indian food, and I was super jealous, but I had gone with Molly to the grocery store, and I picked up some cookies, these chunky chocolate chip cookies. They were gluten free and dairy free. And I went and grabbed some out of my car and ate on the walk between bars. And JP, trying to be a smart ass, said, oh, are those gluten free? Why yes, yes they are gluten free. Are they dairy free? Yeah, they are. He thought that I was just f***ing with him. No, are they really? Yeah, bro. Do you want to see the box? They're in my car. They're decent. I like them. They do contain eggs though, but they're pretty good. Oh, I was gonna go grab my phone so I can text Diana so we can schedule a mulligan move-in day because if you've been watching the vlogs, you know that when we go to Thailand, probably not gonna bring the cat. He is going to be moving in with my friend Diana and her two cats, Ruthie and Bruno, and hopefully he'll be getting more exercise because he's becoming a little, little fatty. Good news, my neighbor's package didn't come so I didn't have to have that responsibility. Now I'm gonna go pick up Dave and I am such a slob today. I felt like such a slob at work. I've literally just been sitting on my butt since I've gotten out of work and it's nearly 6.30 and I'm just like in a cutoff that has like dropped food on myself. I've watched at least four hours, I feel, of YouTube videos, mostly Try Guys. Let's go get Dave. Hi, boo-boo. Hi, boo-boo. Good boy. You're so cute. What are you doing? You don't do this. You don't do that. You must really want attention. You know what it is. You want soft food, but your hard food is not gone yet, so you need to finish your hard food before you can have your soft food. It's true. That's the rule. That's the rule. Yeah. Oh, Dave just popped into the shower. Oh, gosh. I just spent so long editing because I feel like a snail today. And these are the days that my brain just goes, nah, nothing matters. It's not a thing. Maybe it's just because I'm sleepy and maybe I'm reading too much into it. I can't tell right now. <laughs> maybe I'll feel better tomorrow. Hopefully I'll feel better tomorrow. So I've got Shelby's bridal shower tomorrow and I'm part of the convoy to pick her up. I should probably make sure that my camera is charged for tomorrow. Oh, my ever loving, I'm so tired. I'm gonna close this vlog out here and hope that tomorrow is a better day and that it's less of a snail day. So thank you so much for watching. 
give this video a thumbs up if you made it this far. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you next time.